Hi everyone, welcome to Narish Technologies. This is Srinivas. So, in this session, is we are going to discuss so one simple interview question. So, that is, what is garbage collector? Question is, question, what is garbage collector? So, first of all, as so we know that garbage means what? It is a scrap. But, sir, in Java application, so, means what as where the garbage is available, where the scrap is available is means. So, generally in Java application execution starts from the main thread. Suppose, this is the main thread is a main thread. So, from the main thread from the main thread you can create n number of threads n number of threads you can create. So, means what there is no strict rule that and here it is only one thread will be created is a child one child two so many threads you can create so many threads but see wherever you create object maybe in a main thread maybe in a child one thread maybe in a child two thread so where objects will be created objects will be created inside the heap area so maybe in a main thread maybe in a child two child three child four uh, suppose we, here it is we are writing heap memory objects will be created in the heap memory only these are objects considered. So, what is that garbage collector thread will do garbage collector it is a daemon thread garbage collector is a daemon thread as we know that daemon thread it is a service thread it will provide the service. So, to whom it is providing service to all the non daemon threads here it is a main thread child thread right a child two thread all these are non daemon threads non daemon threads execute application logic so a garbage collector thread is a daemon thread that will provide service to all these non daemon threads sir what is that non daemon th means what what is that service simple see here main thread child thread child two thread creates objects inside the heap area only. Suppose, in the heap area one object has created, but no one is pointing to that object, no one is using that object just created that is it. No one is using that is unreferenced, non-referenced. So, such type of objects are eligible for garbage collection by maintaining that object in the heap area no use, it is a waste, it is a scrap. So, it will delete that memory, it will delete that memory allocated to that object and reacquiring the space, reacquiring the space. So, that so that make it available to the next object is created by these three threads nothing but available threads in the Java application. So, simply garbage collector thread is a daemon thread it will provide service to non daemon threads non daemon threads means the threads which are running in the application a daemon thread means what is a back back end thread so what service it is providing it is deleting it is deleting unused objects in the heap memory and recollect that heap space to create the new objects by all these non daemon threads sir who will create that garbage collector thread JVM will create that garbage collector thread and JVM only start the GC thread and stops the GC thread when required. Okay, so, we means what as a programmer we no need to take care of that garbage collector thread. Okay, so, hope you understood. So, what is a garbage collector? It is a thread, it is a daemon thread. So, remember. Okay, for more videos, please subscribe to Narayshati channel. Thank you. Thank you all.